Jabai is celebrating her boo birthday. Happy birthday. Yes, he's having his birthday today. She's in celebration. I'm going to tell y'all something. He's such a great dad because I am Facebook uh, fans with this couple and uh, they don't show that. I mean, they're always active in the community. This man right here always doing things with his kids. They're, 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 they are very into sports. Oh, look at KK when she was pregnant. They're so into sports, right? But they never show this. They never show Kiki and her husband doing family things, yeah. Now, their son is so much into sports until he is really, uh, he got all these professional, uh, professional colleges, not professional college, y'all, but y'all know what I'm trying to say. They're looking at this young man. I can remember when Tiffany made me mad because they moved to another district in order to, you know, for their son to have a better chance when it comes to uh, his athletic ability. Tiffany was trying to accuse them of just, you know, giving other addresses so this child can qualify for his uh to be in this athletic event. But I really don't know why my soul said that she was jealous over Kiki and one of her life, over Tisha and one of her life, because my soul, you act like having a kid cramped your style. But this man right here is active into his children's life. He's active around the house. He takes care of his family, his children. He does it all, you guys. We don't see that. Now, oh, that is a cute picture now. 
Anyway, happy birthday to you. Singing. Oh, look at Kiki when she was younger. They're such a cute couple, you guys. Yeah. Hey, oh, man. Great dad. Great dad, oh, man. Great dad. This this is a beautiful couple, and I surely wish that I could see more of this on uh, Love and Marriage Huntsville. But I tell y'all the truth, Kiki carried it. She carried that show last season. Yes, she did. Okay, taking her birthday, the beautiful Vanessa Roger Tracy offering happy eighth birthday to my granddaughter, Maria. Oh, Kareem hopes AKA Ghost Baby. Hashtag official and Nikki. So, this is Melody Sheree. Oh, she says, super duper blessed. Man, when I say you can sit back and let people run their mouth and mess up their own, I mean, I was hoping that <laughs> when talking too much goes wrong. Hashtag fear not. Hashtag trust God. She, I, oh, I do know one person that talked too much is Blabbermouth the Harlot and that it's her husband's hotel. Hotel talk so much on Tasha K to the big blogger. Yahoo got into it. Let's see what Yahoo is saying. Man, you talking too much. And not only that, Yahoo and the sun, everybody in on this. You have bought so much attention to you, but you thought you were bringing the, the attention to Melody. You thought that everybody was going to look at Melody's side eye and a negative eye, but bro, you talk too much. And then you guys, this man indicate that he's jealous over his own kids. Don't even want his kids to have financial support. He don't pay child support, right? He don't support the children. But what did he tell us? Yeah, Melody wants the kids back on social media so they can make money, so they can bring income in the house. Income that you benefit off of. Income where she buys food for your home. Coming from the M and M children, yeah, you talk too much. Now we do know that that was your motive. Your motive was not because you felt like the children' life was in danger. Your motive was because you wanted to block those children' bag, but instead you blocking your own bag. What she say, yeah, man? When I say you can sit back and let people run their mouth mess up their own i was hoping bad though and then you got that holler you want the holler even to make money off of your children's off of your children back yeah you feeding that holler off of your children food that she sits over there anyway yeah when talking too much goes wrong Let's see what he said about these kids. He talked too much. We do know that when he took those kids off of social media, it was not for their safety, but yet to block their bag. So we're talking about envy and jealousy that Martell has, right? On this case, you know, he goes down now to the courthouse and they serve him some paper. First thing he do now is throw his brother under the bus. He has no loyalty to no one. No, not me. You don't you don't know me, me. You gotta be talking about my brother. And then on this episode of Tasha K, he really, really, really let everybody know that mom loved my brother more than he loved me. Because after all, he was the bad kid and I was the good kid. The yeah. star in college playing football and, and, and or, or making a million dollars. 
I love him just as much as I love you, son. You know what I'm saying? You're jealous. Because he the baby. Nah. <clears throat> And then, so I just picked him up from school, picked yeah. my kids from school. So I dropped my daughter off at 10 and said, oh, let me go get, grab his document right quick. So I left the two out, out in the car, ran in to grab the document. The lady said, hold on, Mr. Hope, one moment. <laughs> you know, wait one moment for the damn police officer to come and get me. I said, he came out and said, you got a warrant for your arrest. I said, no, they can't be right. You must be talking about my brother. I said, check it out. Not you trying to put it on your brother. Hey, because I didn't know. I mean, because it didn't make sense. I'm upset because he can't make profit, right? His envious and his jealousy of Melody because Melody has excelled. He no longer could pimp Melody to go out there and make money for him so he can go and brag about himself, by him being the breadwinner. So he can go and throw money to all his side chick like as if he's a big baller. But if you look at these kids, these kids are uh, saw their mama. She's getting ready to perform at an event. I think this event was in Huntsville, you guys. But he bought these children. Look at how happy they are it's just to see mom. Their hugs and smiles and oh my God. They just love their mom. And for this man to try to go on social media and uh, uh, go on social media and just try to demean this woman. Anyway, let's just see what he's saying. This breeds jealousy and envy. He's going to talk about Melody uh, promoting him to sell him, to make money off of him, and he's pissed. <laughs> well, damn. Yep, yep, yep. So that it's all good. It's a good punch because I'm a, if I'm a wife, right? I'm a wife. It's my if I'm a wife, and here's this woman that's been around for so long. I at this point, I would just have to embrace her, and I felt like that's what Melody did, but it was more profitable to, to sell you. Yeah. That's what she did. This is what she's doing right now, too, though. That's exactly what she's doing right now. I mean, I would do it. Yeah. As a woman, you know, and I'm in. <sighs> I'm for, like I said, I'm for black families, and I just wish there was some type of way without television being involved that you two could just. I think it would be more entertaining at this point to have Ariana on the show and to have, you know, her partner on the show and just. Kind of let y'all go at it at this point, like how Quad and you know Doctor is it Lunsford did it, like how he introduced his his new wife and yeah, you know it's 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 more entertaining that way. Like oh my god, like a I want to say a mistress, but you know another woman, your husband's still on the show. There's a whole another wife and yeah, yeah. Like I don't I just, know if they, I don't know if um she or like like Erin to come on and take the spotlight. Yeah, I. I, I both of you are intellectual inferior. You could never take the spotlight away from Melody. Actually, from nobody. Hell, shit. They say Zeus didn't even want, want uh, Arian. If Arian can audition for Zeus and they say they don't even want us, there's a problem. But both of you guys are intellectual inferior. You could never take the spotlight. And that statement in itself is a stupid statement. How are you going to outshine the creator of the show? If she thinks she can outshine Melody, then why don't she do her own thing? Why are you guys still trying to piggyback off of this woman's success? You want to ride that wave of success with her. You so jealous to you. You just up here just wanting her to fall. You so jealous to you'll say anything. You will even have Erin on your arms when you going out places of success with successful people. Erin not on your arm. If she's such, such a shiner, why don't you have her on your arms when you go to your different events? You have every other woman on your arm except for Erin. You didn't even take her to uh to to uh, Stormy's birthday party, and that was right. In, and that was outside in the pasture, just down the street, just down the street from uh where Arian lived. 
yeah, jealousy and envy moving this man. Let's just keep it moving. Oh, no. It's, it's it would be, and I feel that that's, I think, what Melody would be, like, kind of scared of. Like, maybe Ariane would take the spotlight 100%. from her. 100%. You think not, so? As I'm not, Melody would be like, let's do it, you know? But I'm, she's against it now. Yeah. Her, or could it be like, uh, you know, you already took my husband. You're not about to take my the benefits. Yeah. Which I can honestly see from a wife's perspective. Yeah. Yeah. You know. But stop talking about her. Oh, don't allow us to talk. Don't, don't allow us to talk. About like, let's stop having, let's even mit- stop mentioning her. Period. You know. This big mouth girl is the one always talking about herself all over, over internet, everywhere. And you, nobody talks about this woman unless this woman come forth herself with a bunch of bull. Both of y'all intellectual, inferior, and both of y'all just zooming with jealousy and envy. Your jealousy or your wife is a problem. So much to you will ban your children from making money because they the children are outshining you. You try to put a little chucky, throw a little chucky in our face. You took your children off the media, then put little chucky up there thinking that, that you can make little chucky out of a star and make him out of an M M&M and M kid. But that didn't even work. If that's the case. Don't um let's what do you love about Ariel? That's a great wine. I'm t- listen, I'm telling you. <laughs> what you love about Jesus. this wine?